Yoohoo, hello guys, welcome to my channel, it's Eager Plus Action Trader. So in this channel you will learn about money management, the difference between a trader and an investor, and, and forex, and also leverages, and also money management that you can use in order to make profits. So this is strategy that I'm giving you, you can make money with it in trading. So there is a saying that the more you learn, the more you will earn. Yes, this is true for all for what for all things that we do this is for true so today we will talk about retracement retru how when retracement will occur okay this is very important and uh, i need to explain more in this with this in this i need to explain more especially for beginners who don't know what is a round number comment below what is a momentum comment below i have already made videos on trend the different types of trend how you can trade with the trend and how to use trend line okay so if you don't if you haven't watched this video watch it you can find the video in my channel so with the trend you will find the market structure this is very important okay important because retracement will not happen in a ranging market let me show you here you cannot expect a retracement these are not called retracement okay because the market is moving in a range okay there is no retracement for example here let me show you here we do not expect a retracement this is a consolidation area it operates in two range you see these are not uh, these are not um, retracement retracement occur in um, in a trending market and you see here when retracement will occur it will occur at strong level where there is a momentum or where the level in uh, where the level uh, where there is a strong selling you see a strong sellers a strong seller a strong sellers and you see this is all retracement this is called a retracement okay this is called a retracement let me write it for you guys to, to understand this is a retracement okay so retracement occur when there is a momentum right where there is a mo momentum but always remember that a retracement is not only one candle it can be two it can be three okay it depends okay but now you have also one which is a retracement for many people see that if there is a strong bias and the next candle will go up no this is not true this is a retracement where sellers will enter because this candle show an exhaustion okay an exhaustion of buyers okay so this is a retracement that i have show you let me show you more example okay for you guys to understand okay let me show you the difference between a retracement and a reversal let me show you so first the market was going down you see this is a downtrend okay so which means that at this level here at this level there is a reversal a reversal means that this is a reversal where you see that they it make a trend okay you let me show you let me write it for you got to understand so reversal reversal change trend right okay so the reversal change trend you see it go down and after at some point here at some point it will go up so this is a reversal okay this is also a w pattern okay a w pattern. you need to know this pattern comment below i will make a video if you never heard of w pattern and pattern just make it just comment below i will show you how you can you can uh, how you can trade with the w pattern so always remember that some in uptrend the market is moving like this right oh sorry let me erase it okay to make it clean for you guys to understand i'm doing this for you to make it a, okay so you need to understand that in uptrend the market is moving like this okay the market let me write it the market oh god my handwriting is so bad okay the market is moving 
like this in uptrend right you will see in uptrend that the market will uh, will move like this and you should see very carefully is that let me make it more simple so the market is moving like this right and what happened is that these are retracement this this all retracement so you can expect a retracement happen here you cannot expect that the buyer will go up 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 and continue to go up or the uh, the seller will continue to go down so these are the retracement you see this is a retracement okay these are the retracement where we can expect buyers or sellers enter right so these are the retracement and in order in order for you guys to trade this retracement okay so a retracement always appeared at a strong level right at a strong level we can see a retracement let's see here you see a, a very strong downtrend okay let's check if there is a level let's see okay you will see if there is a level right for for you guys i have tested if this is a real market i'm i am not lying to you you see you see and this is a level this is a reversal point where the market reversed you see and what happened is that when the market come at this level you we do not we do not expect that we do a retracement if it is a reversal we should expect a a strong bias enter but what happened this is a retracement because we see that we see that this is a a small candle okay we see a smoke we see a new high we see rejection from sellers and this is a a momentum which means that this candle can stop the momentum so in this way you will find a retracement you see a retracement happen here because it is a lever you see this is a lever where strong bias a strong bias strong bias so i am not lying if i have told you that retracement appeared when there is a where there is a reversal point where buyers enter strongly in the post so this is a retracement and you see that the sellers try but for some people who see that it is a strong seller they will try to to bet down because this is a very strong strong candle and the, there is a momentum which is continuously three or four candles at the same color so most people will go down but it will lose because a retracement happened at strong level you see this level i have shown you this is a very strong level so in this way retracement will happen we cannot expect we cannot expect a retracement here yes this is also a bad market so don't trade with this market if you are experienced then you can trade but trade with practical account for you to trade so you see this is a you cannot expect a retracement here this is not called a retracement okay this is not a retracement because why because if you see the market is moving in this range right it is not a trending market it, if it is a trending market we should expect retracement so this is not a retracement this is a consol consolidation area okay so this is not a retracement okay so a retracement happen when there is a trending market let let take other example for you guys to understand okay if you see here this or let me show you in large chart which is very so this all retracement okay i have explained to you that <coughs> sorry okay if you see here these all retracements that i have shown you in the picture that the market will move like this right the market will try to move like this and if it's if it is a downtrend the market will move like this so this is a retracement the two candles we cannot expect a retracement on only one candle okay there can be two there can be four or there can be five you see when the retracement happen is that the market will continue again you see it is an uptrend right most people say that it is an uptrend the next price the price will continue to go up no this is not true the market is not moving like this okay we should expect some bias and what happened is that bias enter and then it will continue its pattern okay so retracement is a temporary temporary change right it is temporary it doesn't change if it is a reversal what will happen tell me guys what will happen if it is a reversal okay if